Hey everybody, I'm here with an unfortunate I told you so. Last December, President Biden, Speaker Pelosi, they forced Congress to do something unprecedented. They made us vote on specific conditions for the railroad labor union negotiations. Now this has never happened before and when we took the vote, I made a prediction. I especially do not believe that Congress should be stepping into the middle of a labor dispute and setting the terms of the agreement. This sets a terrible precedent. It tells unions across the country that they can hold Congress and the American people hostage to get the deal that they want. This was a bad situation all around. And to say how that plays out, right now, West Coast longshoremen in California, they're negotiating their next labor contract. So if anybody thinks that they're gonna accept anything less than what the rails just had codified by Congress, then they're crazy. And so Congress has now set that bar of what's going to happen for labor, which is again, a massive inflationary policy for everybody across the country. It indeed did set a terrible precedent. Right now, ports across the West Coast are shut down due to a labor strike. As a result, not only are the American goods not moving across America, we are not able to import or export our goods abroad. The supply chain has been a mess for several years now, and this is only going to make the problem worse. I don't like to say that I told anybody so in this situation, because it hurts every single one of us. It hurts people trying to get the things that they need at home, in their businesses. It's a situation that was avoidable, and that now we have to fight to correct. In the meantime, Florida is open for business. And I'm confident that the Port of Miami would be happy to take on the extra work and the extra economic boost from anybody that wants to send their goods to the free state of Florida. Hey everyone, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed the video, please click like and subscribe. I will be back on YouTube with more exclusive content, so stay tuned.